I think I'm ready. Got my shirt on, shorts, you know. I got my socks. Wait, I'm just missing one thing. Girl, the bonnet. Gotta hit a bonnet. Now I'm really ready. Period. Okay guys, all jokes aside, that is not okay. It is 2021. We are not showing up to our day appointments with big t-shirts, some shorts, and some Mitch Matt socks and a bonnet. That's not what we're gonna do. <laughs> Unless we're in like a relationship for like 20 years, but that's not what we're gonna do over here. So if you guys are interested in seeing how I get ready for my day appointment, then stay tuned and I will meet you guys in the shower. Oh, one more thing before we get started. One more thing. Um, I did get my wax yesterday and I got my nails and my toes done. Um, European Wax Center was really strict on recording. So I didn't get to record while I was in there. But just know I am freshly waxed. My nails and toes are freshly painted and polished and scrubbed. And I'm like oh so ready. So yeah, like I said, I'm going to meet you guys in the shower. Dr. Bronner's soap on my extremities. I have the peppermint right now. I like to use that on my extremities because I know that it really gets the dirt and oil out, but I don't use it anywhere else, my privates or anything, just because uh, it's very harsh and it makes my skin feel very stripped and it irritates me. But I make sure I get all my other good body parts really, really good. Get those feet, girl, because guess what? They finna be in somebody's mouth. <laughs> So I wash up and rinse off twice and then I go in with some Dove liquid soap because that makes my skin feel really really good and nice and soft so after I scrub with the harsh soap I go in with the liquid soap and I again I don't use this on my private parts yet because I like to use unscented natural soaps down there but I still wash up everything else still get the butt still get everything else girlfriend <laughs> and then I'm gonna go in with my Dove sensitive skin unscented soap and then I'm gonna get all in the hoo-ha I'm sorry I gotta see my bun but I gotta be seeing what I'm doing I gotta get all in the folds and the creases all in the butt and when I tell y'all I get in the butt, I get up the butt in the butt. Just because, like, if he gonna eat your butt, like, you gotta make sure that joint is squeaky clean. Like, so I don't care. Ain't no shame in my game, girl. I get all up in there. Okay? Period. <laughs> Up. Shit is a tongue twister. <laughs> I am going to just put that everywhere and use my exfoliation scrubber and scrub, scrub, scrub. It smells so good, but my favorite is Brazilian nut. Y'all, then I had to hop out of the shower to grab my perfume, but I'll explain that later. But right now I'm going in with Smooth Me and Reveal Me from the Brazilian Wax Center. I always buy their products. So the Smooth Me is like these little pads you see that I'm about to scrub on. Um, it helps with ingrowns and exfoliation. And then the Reveal Me is just like a smoothing gel. You guys, I don't play when I exfoliate because it be neat and it be nice and smooth down there. 
like butter and then i saw someone spray their shower with perfume before and ever since then i've been doing it because it makes your shower water and the steam and just everything smell like perfume and i feel like it just makes you smell better on top of the lotion and perfume you're already about to put on and then i'm just going to finish it off with some coconut oil because i love for my skin to feel soft i have the coconut oil from shea moisture and now it's time to get out smooches okay guys so here are some of the things that you may need um just like a couple little toiletries the old random lotion of course alcohol i'll get into that when i put it on of course you want to brush your teeth you gotta have that breath smelling all nice and good um your favorite perfume i decided to go with some shenane today <laughs> A good lip scrub, because baby, you can't begin to be able to press your lips. Mm -mm. And then, just like a little bit of makeup. I mean, I'm not going to go in for a full beat, but I just, you know, want to do like a no makeup makeup look. So I can be looking as cute as possible and not looking like a crazy. Okay, guys. Ready? So, I'm going to start off with brushing my teeth. And be in there with um, Dragon Breath. <laughs> Hey, that is unwanted physical contact. Hey, what are you doing? Okay, 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 let's, let's just back up a little and take this one step at a time. I mean, we really should get to know each other first, you know, as, as friends or maybe. That's a no no. Alrighty. So, let's get this thing popping. smelly goods right okay so the reason why I'm using alcohol is alcohol um does it clog the pore no it opens the pores so that when you put on the ornaments the ornament will last way longer it'll feel and it'll prevent sweating yeah it seems to work for me so I basically just pour some in my hands there my arm here and then I'll put some under here and I'll let it dry then we're gonna put on some handy dandy deodorant. So I just started using Dove. This is advanced care, no white marks, on 100% color, invisible, sheer and cool. Lasts, oops, sorry you guys didn't see me. Lasts for 48 hours. Even like strong, it doesn't make my underarms hurt because I have sensitive skin. Um, and it's not, it doesn't smell extra strong. It smells very natural, very good. All right, so the odorant is on. Next, I will put on lotion. So the perfume that I have just will happen to come with lotion. If not, I'll just use regular lotion. Um, I do not use lotion on my private areas because it tends to irritate. And after I just got a fresh Brazilian, you don't want to use any perfumed products or strong products in that area. So I'll just go ahead and use some more of that coconut oil from Shea Moisture that I used in the shower. I'll just put that down there instead. Or I'll just use regular lotion. This coconut oil on my private areas, my feet. It's virgin coconut oil, daily hydration body oil by Shea Moisture with coconut milk and some other stuff that I cannot pronounce. Yes, I am a nurse and I'm a little dippy at times, but you know, who is it? Get the booty, you know, get all up in there because you don't want your butt, your butt crack loaded to be cashy. So make sure you get all up in there. We're going to get into these feet.
That way I can really give the sexy eyes, you know? And then we're gonna go in with my super black eyebrow pencil by Mario, makeup by Mario. A little lip scrub while I do my hair, and then you know, put on a little glossy gloss, and we're good. No, we're not. We're good out of the bathroom. Then we gotta go to the bedroom so I can show y'all. Okay, so. Rule number one, always keep a scrunchie on your wrist. So there's that, but I like to, you know, have my hair down at first. My hair got wet in the shower, so it's literally, I'm not straightening it because this is one thing I don't get messed up. So I still have some scrub boys, so I'm just gonna rub it in. Tatcha lip mask, which I sometimes wear as a freaking gloss outside. I don't care, it's freaking amazing. It just gives you that stretch, that ooey gooey. Look at that ooey gooey, y'all see it? That's how I'm gonna be saying off. <laughs> just kidding, guys. Smelling good, looking good. Now it's time to go feel good. This is gonna be what I put on. It's giving pretty in pink. You guys, I also always have some wine set up and a candle. It just really sets the vibe for me. I love me a candle, especially a relaxing candle and wine always just puts you in that mood. Oh, I'm ready. Let me get dressed. Let me get dressed.